Hello kitties and welcome back to Choo Choo Charles. I'm your host, Candy the Cat Morale. And a lot of you guys wanted to see me play more of this game, so here I am. And I'm really glad that you do because I really want to avenge my buddy Eugene and get revenge on Charles. Okay, so, in the previous episode, uh, we did go past one of the missions and kind of missed it. So we're gonna go back and uh, do that mission, so yeah. Okay. And hopefully Charles won't show up and kick my butt and uh, destroy my train, because I kind of needed to kill him. <laughs> but we can't really do that until uh, we get all of the three eggs, apparently. So yeah, we have to find the mines and get the eggs. And now we have a beautiful green train. Lovely. <laughs> so I guess like the paint cans are like a collectible in this game or something. So I suppose I'll try to find uh, all of the paint cans too and get all of the colors of the rainbow for my train. <laughs> okay. Oh jeez, why is this mission so far out into the forest? Oh. I saw that in the corner of my eye as I was running. I saw some scrap there. <laughs> but yeah, thank you so much, guys, uh, for the support in the previous episode. All of you guys were really happy to see me back again, and that means a lot. <laughs> oh. What the heck? There's a witch lady here. Well, hello, darling. Hello, witch. I'm making a fresh stew. Ow. With ingredients from my very own swamp. But I don't have any meat at the moment. Ah, you want me to find some? I smell a carcass on the island in the swamp. Ew. And if you wait over there and bring it back for me, I'll pay you some scraps. Okay. Although, You'll need to be wary of Barry, the swamp monster. What? Keep an eye out for him splashing around. Oh, God. And don't move if he gets close to you. As long as you stand still, he's as kind as a kitten. Oh, great. I got to deal with a swamp monster now? Oh, my goodness. Okay, whatever. It's all for the scrap, I guess. Oh, a note and some scrap, too. Okay. <laughs> A uh, tasty, yummy stew recipe. Swamp water, salt, clover, dirt, salt, <laughs> meat, any kind, human included, <laughs> and salt again. Well, that's a very salty stew now, isn't it? <laughs> okay, cool. Maybe we can sell that at Candy's Burgers and Fries. The tasty, yummy stew. All right. Oh, gosh. Okay, here we go. Ah! Oh, God. I can hear the chew-chewing of Charles. Oh, is that the swamp monster? Okay, don't worry, Barry. No one's here. No one's in the swamp. Oh, jeez, he's getting closer. Okay, he backs off if I stop. That's good to see. Okay, great. No, no, back off, buddy. Oh, my goodness. So, so far, we've seen Choo Choo Charles, some evil mask guys with, like, guns, and now a swamp monster? Are you kidding me? Oh, man, why would anyone want to live on this island? All right, some scrap here. Oh, is that the carcass? Ew. Did Charles kill that? Oh, my goodness. I wouldn't be surprised. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Oh, no. Is that Charles? I hear the choo-choos. Oh my God, I see him. Oh no, he's not coming. Oh my God, what the heck? Okay, I wasn't expecting him to come this fast. Ah, what the heck? Okay, run, 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 run. Sanctuary, sanctuary. <laughs> oh jeez. oh no, the witch lady is gonna die just to give me scrap. Oh my God. He can't destroy this house, can he? Because if he can, I'm kind of screwed. Oh my god, he is mad. <laughs> yeah, get out of here, Charles. Oh, oh no, he's coming back. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, yeah, get... Okay, I keep thinking that he's gonna get out of here, but then he comes back. Um, guys, help. What do I do here? I don't know how he didn't kill that witch lady, but maybe she can't be killed. <laughs> maybe she's an unkillable NPC. All right, um, so yeah, what do I do here? I don't have my train. I don't have any guns. Do I throw a scrap at him? Can I sick the swamp monster on him? <laughs> he probably killed the swamp monster. He's probably trampled on him by now. Well, rest in peace, Barry, I guess. <laughs> oh. Uh, is everything okay now? 
The witch lady kind of calmed down, so I'm guessing that he's gone. Oh my god. No, don't come back, please. Oh gosh, I'm not gonna lie, guys. I'm kind of scared. Why is this game so scary? Like, this is a really silly game, but I'm kind of feeling the intensity right now, and I'm kind of scared. He's still pretty close. What do I do? <laughs> is he coming back? I can't even tell. I think he's sticking to, like, the railway. I don't know. Okay, here's your stuff. Oh god, he's coming back again. Here are those scraps. Okay, I okay, hurry up, hurry up. Have a safe night, little one. Yeah, you too. I don't know how you didn't die, but whatever. Is he coming back again? Oh my god. Charles, can I play the game? Jeez! <laughs> okay, I think it's safe to leave now. Stay safe, witch lady. Alright. Need to get back to my train. I need a waypoint so I know where I'm going. Oh no. What are you doing, witch lady? Guys, I'm so scared. Oh my god! No, 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 no. What the heck? Are you serious right now? How am I supposed to play this game if this train is camping my sanctuary? I need to get back to my train. You know the proper train? Not the stupid, ugly, demon monster train? Get the heck out of here, you jerk. I want to play this game. I've been stuck here for so long. Oh my goodness, this is getting ridiculous now. Well, I'm glad this sanctuary is impenetrable. Seriously, what do I do here? Do I just have to accept death? But the thing is, if I die, like, how far back in the game is it going to send me? Well, I guess this game does autosave, right? Oh, God. Jeez, he almost trampled me. Can you please back off? Yeah, keep going away. Does he come back when I leave the house? I don't know. Kind of seems like it. Do I just wait here until he decides to go away? What are you doing? <laughs> what the heck? He seems... Oh, God, okay. Stop. He seems very confused. And also, like, why does he even look like a train? That's why I'm confused. I understand why he's a demon spider thing, but why does he look like a train? Is he some kind of shape-shifting monster? All right, well, this is getting kind of silly, so I think I just kind of have to make a run for it, and if I die, I just have to accept my death. <laughs> All right, let's just get the heck out of here, because I don't know what else to do. Ow! Ow! Excuse me. Ow, ah, my butt! <laughs> oh, no! Oh, I got me. Ah! <laughs> Derailed. Oh, I lost scrap. Ah, crap. <laughs> well, oh, scrap, I guess. Oh, man. Okay, well, I only lost two scraps. So that's not too bad, I guess. I still got 33. Oh, my God. Like, Charles did literally just not want me to play the game. <laughs> he was a camper. He's a dirty camper, man. Man. Okay, well, that was kind of stressful. I'm not going to lie. Um, which mission should we go to next? Let's do this one. Why not? <laughs> oh, great. So it does seem like Charles's uh, encounters must be random, I guess. I don't know. Still not 100% sure on that, but whatever. <laughs> it's funny, guys. I was thinking after I recorded the previous episode, I was thinking, since there's so much scrap in this game, maybe the scrap animatronic should have played this game, like Scrap Trap and Scrap Baby. That would make sense, right? <laughs> oh, well, too late. Suck it, Scrap Animatronics. <laughs> I'm not scared of you with your creepy claws and really badly designed uh, Scrap Trap model. I don't care. <laughs> All right. Oh, man, I'm just asking to make enemies now. <laughs> I've already got Choo Choo Charles and the Swamp Monster and these mask guys on my tail. Jeez. Okay, everyone, we are here. Oh, no. Don't tell me I hear the Choo Chooing again. Oh, great. Okay. Oh, I don't like this when I have to run to a mission because 
I feel really vulnerable right now. Like Choo Choo Charles is gonna jump me at any second. How great. Oh man, okay. Let's do the next mission and hopefully not die this time. Oh, hello. You look I interesting. My pickles! pickles? I ate the last jar of pickles I had in my house. And there's only one jar of pickles left on the island. <laughs> my secret jar of pickles. Locked <laughs> away inside my pickle cave. Your pickle cave? I would have gotten them hours ago, but I lost my pickle cave. Ah, your so pickle cave, I'm okay. might have some locked pickles. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> and if you can bring me my special jar of pickles, I'll give you all the scrap metal I have as a reward. Okay, well luckily I already have a locked pickle. <laughs> so, just have to find the pickles and give them back to her. Okay. Alright. I love the pickles. Pickles are the love. Pickles are the life. I love the pickles. They make me feel the happiness. Pickles, pickles, pickles. Love, pickles. <laughs> Okay, great. If only I could go to the pizzeria from Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria Simulator, because that place has pickles, right? But uh, eh, after I made fun of a Scrap Trap and Scrap Baby, that would probably be a bad idea. So, yeah, that was kind of bad timing on my part. <laughs> okay. All right, so now we have to go to another location. Can I jump in this game? I don't know. Uh, can I jump? Oh, I can jump. Okay, I didn't realize that. Cool. I was trying to jump over the fence, but I didn't know what the button was. It's not the X button, which is normally the jump button. It's a different button. <laughs> okay, whatever. Ah, now, we just have to run uh, just over 100 meters and hopefully not die to a demon train. Oh, jeez. I thought I heard something in my ear, but I think it was like a bird or something. Ow. Oh, this game has got fall damage. That's great. Okay. Aha, another paint can. Oh, the purple paint can. Well, a uh, spring trap would like that one, that's for sure. He likes purple. Yeah. All right. Got some more scrap. Pickles. Pickles, pickles, pick, 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 pickles. Pickle. <laughs> okay, great. Pickles are pretty great, aren't they? Okay. Now back to the mini game that Daryl was too dumb to do. Pah, stupid Daryl. Look how easy this is. It's just like a skill check. Oh, yeah, those are pickles, all right. That's a big jar of pickles. Return to the pickle lady to complete your mission. Oh, great, okay. All right, let's just set the waypoint so I know where to go. Why is there so many, like, camps set up on this island? Did those masked guys set up the camps? I don't know. So I guess they must be like cultists, right? So is that Warren guy that was mentioned in the previous episode, is he running like a Charles cult? I'm guessing that's what's going on because the guy that I saw in the mine in the last episode, he was wearing a Charles mask. So yeah, I guess there must be some like crazy cultists or something, I don't know. Okay, anyway. I'm really glad that there's no stamina bar in this game because we have to do a lot of running, so I appreciate that. I appreciate horror games that don't have stamina bars. <laughs> okay, great. Alright, got some more scrap. Also, why is there so much scrap lying around? I mean, it's helpful, but still kind of weird. <laughs> My pickles! Yeah, I got them. I Hey, you're welcome. <laughs> you are my pickle hero. Yes. Here are some scraps as a reward for your valiant pickle questing. <laughs> Thank you. Yes, I have achieved the status of pickle hero. I'm going to brag about that to Freddy when I see him later. I'll say, Freddy Fazbear, I am the pickle hero. <laughs> okay, great. So now, let's move on to the next mission. We have to get back to our train now. And thankfully, Charles didn't interrupt me in that mission. Oh my goodness. <laughs> like seriously, I was worried about the swamp monster and that was the least of my concerns. Well, I guess Charles kind of helped me because he kind of bumped me like over the swamp back to the witch's hut. So I guess he kind of helped. So thanks, I guess. <laughs> okay, great. So now we can make our train purple. Great, we got the purple train. Awesome. Well, we got 40 scrap. Let's make our train really fast and give it some damage too. All right, so now 
will, uh, oh, hang on, we have to go back. Uh, no, that's not the right one, that's the right one, there we go. <laughs> yeah, we kind of missed the mission back here, so, uh, go backwards, please, purple train. William Afton the train. We have to go back, because I want to do all of the missions and get all of the scrap that I can, so I can avenge Eugene. Ha <laughs> ha. All right. And not have stupid Choo Choo Charles kick my butt like he did in the swamp. That was so rude. I mean, like I said, he did kind of help me with the swamp monster, but still, he was just camping. So rude. What a jerk. <laughs> oh man, the rain has really picked up. Oh gosh, that ambiance is really loud in my ears. Meh. Okay, is there anything here? Scrap. Ooh, a paint can. Oh, we got a gray paint can. Well, gray is kind of a boring color, but whatever. <laughs> okay. Wow, a building that I can go inside of. Nice. That's a change. I've been praying someone from the first evacuation group would just send back another boat. But I guess they all think that Georgia's supply boat is still evacuating people. They're all safe and cozy on the mainland, but feel no obligation to make sure everyone else escapes. I know that Charles sinking the boat isn't something anyone would expect. Oh, jeez. But still, to think I would have left this place by now, it makes me sick. Okay, so some people have left the island, but there's still like a select few that stayed behind. Okay. Well, uh, I don't know why you'd want to stay behind, but whatever, I guess. <laughs> Oh, hello. My goodness, the others actually convinced someone to come help us. Yeah, it is I, I so Candy came, Monster Hunter. I yeah. cannot stay any longer. This island is too much for my nerves to handle. Yeah, I don't blame you. I've brought all my belongings here so I can leave immediately when a boat arrives. Okay. Although now that I think about it, I did forget my journal at home. Could you bring it to me? Oh, okay. It's a dangerous <laughs> journey for sure, but you might manage with that train of yours. Sure. I'll give you all the scrap metal I have. Just please bring the journal next time you're here. All right. Well, uh, why does everyone on this island have a bunch of scrap metal like it's some kind of currency? <laughs> That's kind of weird. Well, for all I know, maybe it is the currency of this island. I don't know. <laughs> okay, great. So now we have to find this guy's journal. Where is it? Oh, my God. It's all the way over there. Well, no wonder he doesn't want to do it. It's pretty far, and he doesn't have a train like I do. <laughs> okay, whatever. Great. Oh, gosh. That creepy ambiance is back. What is that? It's so loud in my ears. Okay. Oh, right. I can jump. <laughs> I almost forgot about that. Okay, cool. So at least Charles hasn't been harassing me so far. Oh, my goodness. Okay, let's go. Now we can go this way and go to this other mission. Oh, there's one over there, too? Is that another one that I missed? There is a mine and a weapon mission over there. Um, okay. Did I somehow miss another mission? What the heck? Because isn't that close to where I started the game? I don't know. Well, maybe that mission didn't spawn until, like, later on. I don't know. Wow, we got a train yard. Nice. Okay. Is there going to be a train conductor in here? I don't know, let's see. There's a lot of scrap here, meh. Hello. Welcome to Araniram, archivist museum person. Hey, it's Candy the Cat. Uh, my apologies. I'm not the best with introductions. Oh, that's I okay. I don't believe either of us are here for socializing. No, I'm here for scrap. I just so happen to have a little business opportunity, if you're interested. Oh, really? A very special little box of mine is in a rail car in the nearby canyon. But the goons have set up a camp to protect that area. Uh-oh. So be careful. Okay. Find the blue box and bring it back to me. I'll give you some scraps as payment. <laughs> of course you will. Everyone's got scrap. You get scrap. You get scrap. Everybody gets scrap in this place. Oh, a paint can. Nice. We got a white paint can. Awesome. Okay, cool. <laughs> Man, good thing I searched in here because I almost missed that. All right. Let's go down. Okay. Oh, there's some more scrap. Seriously, I wonder if I can get, like, as many scrap as I need for, like, all of my upgrades without even having to do any of the missions. <laughs> Probably, because there's scrap everywhere. Okay, so we got the gray and uh, white paint cans now. Uh, they kind of look the same. I think that's the gray one. 
And uh, that's the white one. I think the white one looks better, so we'll go with that. <laughs> the gray one is kind of crappy. Okay, so we're almost at speed level 10. And then we're gonna go super fast, supersonic fast, huh? <laughs> oh, ah, oh, crap. Okay, I didn't realize that the uh, objective was gonna be that way. Okay, I gotta screw it up, but that's fine. That's fine. Okay, so we have a weapon mission over there and a mine over there as well. Oh, no, 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 I'm going too far. Crap, crap. No, I don't wanna do this mission just yet. I wanna get a new weapon and also um, the next egg. All right, let's go back. <laughs> <laughs> okay, geez. I'm going all over the place here. Oh my goodness. I have to eat some of my candies, burgers, and fries to, like, get myself back on track. Because, I'm not going to lie, I'm kind of hungry right now. Yeah. And, uh, there's no better place to get food than candies, burgers, and fries. Open seven days a week. So, yeah, guys, uh, come and check it out uh, if you want some good fast food. <laughs> you know, I've been hearing this on the street, but apparently candies, burgers, and fries is way better than those other competitors like Freddy Fazbear's Pizza and also L Chips. Ah! Okay, I don't think Charles likes my advertising. I'm sorry. Well, this episode is sponsored by Candy's Burgers and Fries, and you can just deal with that choo-choo challenge, you jerk. Here, take my Flamethrower Burger Special. <laughs> yeah, you better back off, you jerk. All right, come on, bring it. This time I've actually got a weapon to fight back. I'm not just stuck in a swamp sanctuary for you to destroy me. <laughs> this is for Eugene, this is for the witch lady, and yes, this is even for the swamp monster. You're gonna take it, Charles. <laughs> Burn, baby, burn. <laughs> All right. Okay, so I think maybe I misjudged this flamethrower. In the previous episode, I was saying that this weapon seems kind of weak, but it's doing a pretty good job of keeping him at bay. Look at that. He doesn't want to come close to me. Aw, poor little baby Charles is scared of the fire, huh? <laughs> oh, what was that? What was that yellow box? Does that have scrap in it? Well, I can't really check because I got a stupid demon spider up my butt trying to kill me. Well, take the fire. <laughs> oh my goodness, Charles. You got such a big health bar. Come on. Just get out of here, Charles, you jerk. Oh, yes. <laughs> Victory flames. <laughs> yeah, take that, you jerk. He's scared of me. He doesn't want to do a fight to the death just yet because I don't have all of his eggs. Oh, gosh. Where the heck am I? Oh gosh, I got so lost because I had to drive for so long while that jerk was attacking me. Okay, whatever. Well, there's a mission here, so let's just do this, I guess, but I don't know where I am. <laughs> I was trying to do everything in order, and then, of course, Charles, meh, he had to screw it all up. I mean, seriously, Charles is just more of an annoyance than anything, meh. Oh, a note. Gus the bus, but where the bus? His name is Gus. He's not on the island, though, so don't worry too much. When you go back to the mainland, don't ride the bus. Gus, bus, bus the Gus. He's bad and fast. Charles fears Gus. Chat. Okay. <laughs> okay, let's uh, bring uh, Gus the bus onto the island. Maybe he'll kill Choo Choo Charles. Who knows? Is uh, Gus the bus going to be the sequel to this game? I don't know. But anyway, guys, yeah, today's episode of Choo Choo Charles is sponsored by Candy's Burgers and Fries. Come down today and get a Candy's Burger meal for just $7.50. Now, that's a bargain. And I've been thinking about also uh, selling some pizza to, you know, compete with uh, Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, but don't tell Freddy about that. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, that's a project that's in development. But anyway, so uh, what's this place? Oh, can't go inside. What a surprise. But we got some scrap. That's great. Oh, jeez, what, what, what is this? Oh, gosh, it's blood. Ow! Oh, gosh, okay, now some of my blood is uh, adding to the pile. Great. <laughs> uh, hello. Hey, aren't you the new guy who's come here to work for us? Yeah, that's me, you I must think. be. There's something at the top of these towers that I need. Well, I don't work for you. Yeah, don't worry, I won't make you work for free. I'm just here <laughs> to kill a train. I'm a nice enough guy to pay you. Okay, great. You see, <laughs> Mr. Warren never told anyone from the mainland about his mining operation here. Ah. He never even reported the cave-in. What? He hasn't paid us since then. Our living quarters are atrocious, and I'm far overqualified for the pay I'm supposed to receive. Okay. Top it all off, none of us miners ever received copies of our pepper work. But that doesn't affect my subordinates as much as someone with my status. 
Uh huh. I'm gonna <laughs> sue the pants off of Warren once I escape this island, and I need those Good, files do it. to prove that he breached our contract. All right then. Cool. Well, we can do that, he I guess. He keeps all his files at the top of these towers. I could explain how I ascertained this, but I doubt it would make sense to you. Hey! Problem is, he what erected a jerk. these towers <laughs> years before we ever started mining, and now they're falling apart. Now, great. And you I want me to go up myself, there? But since you're here, go sniff around for those files. <laughs> oh, wow, well, you're reward, too kind, sir. You can have one of my useless pieces of scrap. I bet you'd love to have it. <laughs> uh, yeah, um, if you're gonna pay someone to do something really dangerous for you, you might not want to offer up the reward of something as being useless, you know? It's kind of stupid, you idiot. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, I don't really like this guy, but he's gonna sue Warren if I do this for him, so I guess I should do it, and, uh, Warren is the cause behind all of this madness, I guess. Seems like he was exploiting the people of the island to do all this mining for him, and I guess the mining maybe woke up Charles? Uh, climb the tall abandoned towers to find the missing files for Ronnie. Okay, Ronnie. Gotta climb the towers, I guess. Do we have to do some platforming? Whoa, that was a moon jump. <laughs> okay, oh, that's blocked off. Okay. All right, we gotta find our way to the top, I guess. Get some scrap along the way and another paint can. A lime paint can. Well, that's kind of great. Well, I had green already, but that's like a slightly lighter green, I guess. Eh, yeah, whatever. All right, let's climb to the top. Here we go. Aha, some more scrap. Which is apparently useless according to Ronnie. But what is Ronnie now? Eh. Yeah. All right. Jeez, there is a lot of scrap up here. <laughs> okay. Oh, jeez. Do I have to go over there? That's a long jump. Okay, let's do this. Geronimo! Oh, ow! Well, that kind of hurt my legs, but I still made it. <laughs> okay, great. All right, I saw a note there. But we got some scrap first. All right, can't go down there. Okay. Uh, setting the foundation for this operation has been considerably more complicated than I expected. Not only by cost, but the logistics of construction and delivery of supplies to the primary mine sites. We'll need to strike gold fast if you want any chance of avoiding bankruptcy. Okay, so I'm assuming the mining is what woke up Charles, I guess? I don't know. Or maybe Charles was one of the eggs and Warren hatched it. I don't know. Maybe when they were mining, they found, like, the Charles egg and he hatched? That would make sense, right? I mean, Charles isn't, like, some kind of god or anything. I think. I don't know. Still trying to figure out the lore of this game. Aha, uh -huh, I got the files here. Heh <laughs> juicy secrets. If only I could find out the secrets of Freddy Fazbear's Pizza and what makes their food taste so good compared to mine. I mean, I mean, no, no, Freddy Fazbear's Pizza's food is crap and you should go to Candy's Burgers and Fries. Heh <laughs> yeah. All right, and yeah, don't go to L Chips. They microwave all of their food. It's disgusting. Gosh, and ow, that kind of hurt. Need to figure out how to do this without dying. Okay, good. <laughs> Great. Um, oh, I'm stuck. All right, jerk. Here's your files to sue you Warren. Look like a monkey climbing those towers. <laughs> hey, I don't like sure this guy. I'm glad I found these files. I'm not a monkey. Here's I'm a cat. That scrap you were begging for. Oh, shut don't up. Don't spend it all in one place. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, whatever, jerk. Gosh, that guy's annoying. All right, gotta go back to my train. Let's go. Get the heck out of here. Man, this rain is still going, and the people of this island really just like standing around in the rain for some reason. <laughs> and also, why would you be standing around, like, just outside if Choo Choo Charles is running around, and he's super fast, and he can kill you at any second? Doesn't really make any sense to me. Oh, gosh. Did I just hear the choo-chooing again? Oh, please, no. Okay, guys, so I think that's going to be the last mission for today's episode, because I've been playing for quite a while, almost 30 minutes, which is pretty crazy. But, uh, yeah, so thank you so much for everyone for watching today's episode. Uh, I'll see you guys in episode 3, and also thank you so much to everyone that's been supporting this series so far. Uh, let's uh, change the train to line before we end this episode. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Alright, I'll see you guys next time.
Morale. Bye, everyone.